What's up everybody? I'm Adam, K6ARK Portable Radio, and I am not in California. I'm on a work trip right now in North Carolina, and I've got a little bit of time left, a little daylight this evening. It's about 6.45 p.m. local time, and I'm going to try to squeeze in a POTA activation with the sub one pound POTA pack. If you are fans of Ham Radio Crash Course, you know that Josh has been talking about this one pound Poda Pack challenge. And I put one together that's six and a half ounces. If I add my cell phone to that and count that weight as well, I'm still at about 14 and a half ounces, which is well under a pound for the whole system. And my goal is to achieve his challenge of making a contact on three modes, phone, CW, and digital. So it should be a good challenge. I've got about a oh, five mile drive or so to a local national forest here, and we're gonna see if we can get it done. This should be a lot of fun. All right, we're here. Croatan National Forest and the day use area is open sunrise to sunset. So I don't have a lot of time. Let's find a spot here, get set up, maybe over here, we'll give this a try. So first things first, I'll give you a little tour of the station here. Light AF brand pack or bag here, first aid kit usually. There's my digital adapter cable my battery and power connector, my antenna, SMA connector, uh, FT37-43 toroid and 34 gauge wire with enough to get down to 80 meters, and the true SDX with built-in capacitive touch paddle on the end here. The mic is built in there, and then that's my digital adapter for digital operation. So. Let's get this wire in the air so we can get on the air. So the way I set this wire up, I've got marks on the wire for the different bands. This radio is built for the classic bands, 10, 20, sorry, 10, 15, 20, 40, and 80. I'll try CW first. I think that's gonna be my easiest. Oh, lots of sounds of FT8 on 20. K4 KVC. Let's see if we can get them park to park. US Yes. 5 well, I'm an idiot. I sent him his park first and then corrected that and sent my own. Oh well, I had a little trouble keying there with the cat touch key, but 20 meters is working. Let's see if we can find another park to park on 20 meters. That would be ideal.
Park to park, Kilo 6, Alpha Romeo Kilo, park to park. Park to park, Kilo 6 Alpha Romeo Kilo, park to park. Uh, go ahead, park to park. Kilo 6 Alpha Romeo Kilo, stroke 4, park to park. I'm sorry, you're pretty low on the noise there. Can you come back one more time, please? Kilo 6 Alpha Romeo Kilo, Kilo 6 Alpha Romeo Kilo, QSL. Roger, Roger, 5959 US 4508, 4508. QSL, QSL, good luck and have fun. Yep, thank you for the park, park. I hope you have a great rest of your shoot. Woohoo! I got him. All right. So that's one on CW, one on phone, and now we got to get one on digital. Let's go down to FT8. Oh, the sweet, sweet sounds. All right, set up the rig here. I'll show you what I'm doing. Got uh, the rig set up with the digital adapter plugged into my phone. And bugs on my face. I'm gonna switch over to Vox mode on. And the digital adapter basically acts as an audio attenuator in both the send and receive direction, so I don't overload the phone or the rig in, uh, in its function there. So, radio is getting pulled around a little bit by the trees, but uh, let's see if we're, yep, we're copying audio here. All right, we're transmitting CQ Poda going out. Let's try to work AC2SB. I think he was already kind of working me and I screwed up and hit the wrong button and messed up the contact so we'll see if we can work him now AC2SB I'm trying for you buddy RR73 I think we got him in the log <laughs> oh man I think the job is done that's uh, about 30 minutes No, I swiped the wrong way. On FT8CN, don't swipe right if you, <laughs> unless you intend to get rid of the contact. There we go, K5DZY in the log now. WI4B in the log. Let's try to give N8PEM a call, see if we can work him. Come on, Chris. I know you're out there. KI4DRA coming back to the call. There we go, we got him. I only have eight contacts, I need two more. <laughs> Forgot how Poto works. I, thought, I was thinking I just needed four contacts, but uh, that summit's on the air.
KA4GBE. Woohoo! There's number 10. 599. Pennsylvania. KG5 CIK. All right, well that wraps it up. I've got 13 in the log and I th think it's time to go ahead, break this down, get out of here, head on back to the hotel. Before we do that, I'll give you a quick look at the system here one last time. Got the antenna heading off into the tree there, which you probably can't see because it's tiny, tiny wire. Well, I think that was good proof that it doesn't take a big expensive station to make a POTA activation and get at least 10 contacts in the log using any mode you want. Thanks Josh for the challenge. That was a blast and I look forward to using this little kit on a summit or a park sometime soon. Seventh through everybody, thanks for coming along for the adventure.